Alright, this is Juggernaut Steel Fleet. Customizations of new additions from previous Juggernaut Steel Fleet video. Mostly, I don't know. Alright. As I do with all these zombie trucks I get, I have zombified the zombie yellow one. Black wash on pretty much everything. Looks a lot more gritty, bloody, or well, not really bloody since there's no, uh, no blood. I guess that's kind of blood. I don't know, it's probably a mouth. Could have done better on the back here. And between this Z right here, there's nothing. I don't know why I missed that. Of course, I did all the chrome detail and all, and all that. But it looks a lot better. This is what it looks like default, actually, not really. This is going to be another one I'm doing. This is not how it comes with if you buy the store. The yellow roll cage and white tires is my own doing. You guys, you can see the difference is night and day. The clear winner is the one on the left done by yours truly. I don't know how that, I, that, that hair and that ponytail doesn't even match in color. I get that's probably supposed to be frosted tips since this zombie is a woman apparently. But uh, I don't know, it just looks silly and dumb. I would much rather it look, you know, like a zombie. But uh, yeah, actually let me get a thumbnail real quick. Alright. So I have the zombie collection video on my account already, so go look at that one if you want the other versions of this that have been mummified, zombified, whatever like that. The two mystery motor grave diggers that I got were this one, which I might already have, the GD113. I put it on the blue son of a digger body. Do all the chrome detailing, obviously. Came out decent. I might have, I might actually have one that's already like that. I have so many of these grave diggers, it's hard to keep control. This one, I'm not a real big fan of. I kind of just put it together since I had the parts. The big IT lettering is still fresh. That's why I'm kind of being careful picking this one up. But it's uh, 21, GD121. Uh, green and orange on the side. Or orange and blue on the side. This would be a lot better if I had blue flames or orange flames. So we go with the side graphics more or even pink flames if this had pink flames to match the mountain it'd be goaded but since it has the regular green ones you can't even tell it's different from the top and that's kind of stupid anyway i threw the red red roll cage on here and the gray this is the gray uh or i guess silver silver wolf's head base uh, pretty much i just kind of threw it together because i thought it'd work i don't know if it really does i'm saving my best one for last Altori Loco Black, nothing special about this one. This is just uh, chromed up details, did the BKT lettering. Kind of shittily, I might say, since that B is totally not a B. The more you use the white uh, fine point markers for these BKT lettering, the more scrunched down they get and thicker they get. It's harder to get that precise fine point, you know, crisp BKT lettering because it's all smudgy and gross. But yeah, that'd look a lot better if it was a chrome instead of gray plastic. This one I haven't done yet. It's just going to be that only with the chrome and everything, the BKT lettering. This is my favorite one by far, the Silver Wolf's Head. Well, more like gray. It's actually, you know, gray. So, gray wolf's head on the... 
I keep forgetting that I have to mod podge this and seal it. And I keep on picking it up right by where I'm not supposed to. Did the chrome detailing, obviously. This entire thing is gray, which actually works out because it's a gray body. That'd be a good thumbnail. There we go. Alright, so that's pretty much it. That looks a lot better in person, but yeah, I'm a big fan of that. So, yeah, that's it. Obviously, the two ones I like most are these two. Uh, the Grave Diggers are nice, but I already have pretty much better versions of them. So, uh, yeah, that's it. Farewell.